I had a feeling that yesterday was going to be a very hard day to top. The first thing that we did today was we got on a tour boat slash truck. Basically it was some old vehicle from the Vietnam War that can travel on road and by sea. So basically we drove around downtown Halifax for a while and saw many of the different sites and then after that the boat drove down a ramp and ended up in the sea. While we were in the sea, we were able to see Theodore driving along in the distance. And we also saw this great big huge container ship with a tugboat kind of guiding out of the harbor. We got to see the tugboat detach from the ship and turn around and go back to its own dock to do its own little thing. We also got another view of Halifax Harbor to see kind of how similar it looked to the Theodore Tugboat Show and I'm now getting good at pointing out all the different buildings and all the different docks in the show and identifying them. Good afternoon everyone. We are still in Halifax. This is day three. We just went to a model train store where I bought some lights for my train set but not actually any trains. Right now we are on our way to pick up another friend. We're picking up Jake. He'll probably make it to your guys' condo before Probably. Before we do. This is probably the most iconic thing I've ever filmed. What? The three of you in a line walking diagonally. Oh uh, man, we should just get like a shot of all... Once Jacob's in, we'll get a shot of all four of us crossing the street. Oh yeah. Looks like you went shopping a little bit. Ah. Fancy meeting you here. Yeah, I know. It took you a while. Well, it took two extra days. <laughs> What did you get? Nice. Barnes and Noble, we don't have that. Back at the condo, Jake took out all of the stuff that he brought and shared it with us, and we brought out all of the stuff that we brought. This one is yours. Where did you get a buoy from? Okay, I guess we're taking all of our rides. Pink is pretty rare too. I, I want to say that I have all of them. It's nice to see a ton of stuff. I completely oh, forgot the horse. Here's 10 cents. There he is. Oh, I've never seen one. And we just had a lot of fun playing with it and attaching things together to see what would work. And really, it was the first time that I've played with toys like that with other people my age and had as much fun as I did. What we're doing now is we're going back to my hotel so I can collect my top hat yeah. and my port set so that we can get all of our merchandise together in one picture uh, and well, have a good oh, time. I just had an idea. Next time we do a trip like this, I have to find a way to bring my entire collection. We all bring our entire collection to the in one place. I have not it's, it's been a good day. Again, it's hard to live up to the joy that was yesterday. But today was a bit of a calm down day from the excitement of that. John hardly slept last night. I went to bed around 4 in the morning. I went to bed much earlier than that. What is our safest <laughs> mode of transportation for two. Cali fans to carry top? Why can't I just carry them? Uh, if you're willing. I like. What is wrong with just carrying this thing around Halifax like this? If you lose it. If the ferry's wet. Wow. If the waves come up on it. A pigeon can shit on it. Someone breathes on it wrong. Yes. He has points. It's a boat. It's a very valuable boat worth over okay. $1,000. It is more likely that the airplane I'm on taking this home will crash. 
more life. It's <laughs> just plastic. Let's go. It's fragile plastic. Oh no! I'm just, oh, I forgot. I look did not the, pay a thousand. Look at his dress. Though. It's very esoteric plastic, as you can see, with the very shiny monocle. That is very difficult to do with a little tiny Japanese child labor. Child so let's go. At this point, I made John take the camera so that I could actually be in the vlog, and because. Epi made me carry Top Hat in my hands. My camera is currently in the possession of another human being because I must protect Top Hat. I'm just according the, I'm the to, emergency bodyguard, just like. Oh, according to Epi, Top Hat must be my priority. Now, it was very busy tonight, and that was because it was unintentionally some kind of celebration. It's a long weekend here in Halifax, and I forget what the holiday is, but it was packed down by the docks, and there was a fireworks show happening at 10 o'clock, and Theodore Tugboat was going out with some tourists to go and watch the fireworks from the ocean. I had no idea how we could get on that ship, but I really wish that we had tried. <laughs> Speaking of throwing off the balance, look at this genius idea. V vote in the comments if that placement right there with nothing else on the front of the table is good or bad and we should just actually kill Epi. So, Azula is going to attack us and we have to master waterbending in about 27 seconds. So, oh, let's... possible. Whoa, whoa, there we go, here we go, whoa! Holy sh! Oh my god, whoa! After the fireworks, we wanted to kind of share the great collection of Theodore, Tugs, and Thomas stuff that we had created, so we decided to do a little live stream to show our friends and members of the community. Yeah. We're live. Hello! Hi. No one's here. I remember a video with you opening random Thomas toys on a dirty park bench with a scavenger child. I hope your career hasn't peaked just yet. Ooh. I don't seem to remember this video. Hey, what's this thing? This is a super duper rare one out of eight. <laughs> we take, here in Halifax, we take really good care of our collection. Do you color really think school. that if I showed up to high school with my Theodore Tugboat? <laughs> strut, strut for us. That won't even. <laughs> this is real stuff, ready? Oh, no. Okay. Look over here. 10 out of 10. So after all that was done, I had to head home a little earlier than I wanted to because the last ferry leaves at 11.30 and I'm on the Halifax side, they're on the Dartmouth side, so every day I've had to leave them. Uh, just as the fun was kind of getting started. There's so much more that we want to do together, so much more that we want to watch together, so much more we want to see together, and tomorrow's my last full day in Halifax. I'm going to enjoy it, but it's also going to be sad, because I know I'm going to have to go home after. But that's, that's what all this is, right? So we'll see what tomorrow brings.